You don't have to flee and you don't have to fight. What happens to your body in case of stress? For instance, when you have to do a presentation. Well, it's very funny, but what your body experiences is a kind of fear, anxiety, just for being there, for standing on that stage. And also, maybe you're afraid of the audience, which is absurd, of course. But what happens is that there's a kind of basic instinct from which the level of adrenaline in your body is going to augment, is going to get higher. So all the energy is going to your feet and to your hands because your body is preparing to run away, to flee or to fight. But of course, you don't have to run away, you can't run away and you don't have to fight the audience, preferably not. So you have to tell your body that thing, don't run and don't fight. It's very easy. You just happen to let your feet walk around. Don't do this, because that's your feet wanting to run away, but let them walk, walk around. You can do, do that during a presentation or before a presentation. You can just easily walk around. Tell your body it's okay. You don't have to run. Same thing with your hands. Your hands don't have to fight. You can just shake them a couple of times. And that's a way of telling your body, it's okay. I don't need any adrenaline in my hands. I need it in my head. So you don't have to run. You don't have to fight. And you have to control your breathing. But that's a totally different story too long to tell you in a nutshell today. So remember your feet and your hands.